right, hey YouTube, another video here for you. I'm gonna show you my take on the baby grab and go bag. Uh, we just had a baby two weeks ago, and being the prepared minded person that I am, I put together this little bag we can grab in case of earthquake, fire, social unrest, whatever, if you need to get up and go. And so, as you'll probably hear throughout this video, he's crying in the background. Um, so, this is the SOG. Uh, I feel like it's the SOG Ninja Backpack. It's 24 liters, which is about the perfect size for what I need it for. And uh, let's get to it. So in the top pocket here, I have a laminated inventory list of everything in the bag. It's got the side compression straps. Top compartment, I have a bag of, Ziploc bag of, these are three sections of the Diaper Genie um, bags to store dirty diapers in. So my thought was uh, take one of these out, tie a knot in one end, put a dirty diaper in, twist it off, and that will contain all the good smells and everything. Next up I have a bag of some chucks. So these are three chucks for changing diapers or anything else we might need it for. I have a Ziploc bag of two large kitchen size trash bags. This is a uh, changing mat we can put down for a little guy when we change the diaper. There's a bottle with a nipple top. We have a canister of formula in here I'll show you in a second. So if we're on the road, we don't typically do formula, but in a disaster, you know, we might uh, opt for that. A couple swaddle blankets, just in case they get dirty. Time frame for this bag is about at least 72 hours, so three swaddle blankets, but I can make it stretch up to a week if we have to. Here's that uh, thing of formula. A couple uh, washcloths, just cotton washcloths for cleaning and padding and various other, various other things. I got six of these. And then uh, these are the Costco wipes, two packages of these, which are uh, 100 wipes each, so 200 wipes total can be used for you know changing diapers as well as uh, on the go bathing. And then his current size diapers, 32 pack. And then if we have the wherewithal and we're leaving the house, grab an additional pack of this, so we'd have 64 total diapers. Top pocket up here, I have a little travel size thing of Vaseline, which we use for prevent diaper rash. Another thing of hand sanitizer, spray hand sanitizer. And I put these all in Ziploc bags so they're not going to leak and destroy everything in here. Another compartment, I have four little baby washcloths for bathing and cleaning. And that's it for there. In the side pocket, I have a, this is a glass jar of coconut oil, which we use for uh, moisturizer, skin lotion. Works pretty well with him, doesn't give him any kind of reactions or anything like that. And then lastly, just a bag of clothes. So I have a total of six outfits in here, two beanies, two uh, mittens, and uh, I have it in a bag just in case I were to go in the rain and I don't want anything to get wet. So that's basically it for my baby grab and go bag, just in case, you know, we don't have time where we wake up in, in the middle of the night and we have to you know, jet out of here, then everything's all contained for at least a couple days in this bag. All right, hope you liked the video. Please like and subscribe and leave me any comments for suggestions. Thank you.